Today we're gonna to talk about why you should use keywords when using Google reviews and responding to Google reviews to help increase local SEO and to get more customers searching for you locally. So my name is Matt Frederick. If you haven't yet, make sure you check out our videos and like, share, and subscribe. Just absolutely demolish that subscribe button. Turn on that bell for any post notifications about upcoming videos. Every week we talk about marketing hacks, tips, and tricks. But today we're gonna to talk about why you should use keywords in your Google re review responses to increase local SEO. Today we're gonna to talk about why you should use keywords in your Google re review responses to increase local SEO. The example I plan to use is with my company. Uh, it's a local business you see here in the background, Phone Repair Philly. And I am gonna log into my Google My Business account where you see the reviews. Now, what you're probably wondering is, with these reviews, how does using keywords when responding and replying to the reviews help with Google? Well, Google picks up on this keyword contextual content within the rich snippet and knowledge graph, uh, you know, responses in, in terms of, you know, your Google My Business account showing up and, uh, you know, local search results showing up. For example, let's go over to Google and search for iPhone 8 plus screen repairs near me. All right, when scrolling down, look right here, you can see iPhone 8 Plus screen replacement, iPhone 8 Plus with some of the results here. And they know that because, I'm gonna minimize the screen here, and you can see it in the reviews too. You can see in the reviews, but this place has been a lifesaver, it's actually pulling that keyword response out of the reviews. So, this might be too unique of a search term for it to show up within your page as far as maybe content on your website or products or services offered within your Google My Business. And so Google's gonna know to look through the knowledge panel within your Google My Business account and the keyword contextual content within that account to pick up on these keywords. Uh, if you check out uh, this article from Local Marketing Institute, you'll see that they talk about using keywords in those reviews and review responses. So even if in the review it doesn't mention that specific keyword, you can still respond using that keyword and Google's gonna pick up on it. Uh, and it really does help convince customers and help rank you higher because it is seen as a local search signal. A uh, good article here from Search Engine Journal it talks about all these top 25 aspects and signals, uh, specifically with Google My Business and using keywords within reviews. It doesn't necessarily touch on review responses, but this is a unique tip that we like to dig into. So reviews with keywords and locations, reviews with responses, it's really important. Uh, and you need to respond to all reviews, good and bad, and respond with keywords so they pick up on that. So if we go back to my Google My Business account here, you'll see that we respond to every review. If we go in here, you can click on reviews and then haven't replied. And then you can say, thanks, and maybe say the person's name for getting your iPhone screen repaired with us. If you know exactly what the customer came in or bought or purchased or used you for, for choosing our cell phone repair services. This person said something about getting a phone screen fixed. Quick and easy uh, cell phone screen fix, thank you. So using these keywords and responding to every review is very important. So make sure, log into your Google My Business, go to the reviews that you haven't replied to yet, in reply to every single one, good or bad, don't lash out on customers, respond with a positive tone, and use keywords in that review response. 
Uh, thank you. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them below. My name's Mac with Momentum. I appreciate you watching. And please help the algorithm absolutely annihilate that like button and subscribe button. I appreciate you watching. We have tons of content on our marketing blog at needmomentum.com. I'll put links in the description below. If you found this helpful, please share it with friends. And uh, we'll see you next time for another Momentum Monday. Peace.